Guys, John again. One of the folks that watches my channel has a channel called Science and Technology. They reached out, they're looking to switch from Premiere Pro to DaVinci Resolve, and they asked, is there anything that could replace the adaptive noise reduction? And if you haven't seen it in Premiere Pro, you analyze a clip, it takes maybe a second or two to analyze it and then drops and, and reduces out of the, the bottom of the sound any of that kind of consistent rumble in the background, the humming, the buzzing, and it works pretty well. The problem with it is every clip then starts with and then it goes away, and that is pretty annoying. So the question was, is there something that I can do in DaVinci Resolve that accomplishes a similar task in a better way? So I've recorded all of this audio on a cardioid mic here, sitting right next to the back side of my computer. My hope is I pick up enough of a noise floor that I'm able to demonstrate the challenges and how to do it in DaVinci Resolve. Okay, so I have a clip here with a lot of noise. So the question was, and we will now hit Shift 7. Alternatively, we could just click on the music frame down here at the bottom for Fairlight Audio. And I'm going to zoom in by holding down the Alt key and scrolling my scroll mouse wheel forward. And now you can see this is my individual clip. What I need to do is add an effect to it. I can do that here on the right in my mixer. If you don't have the mixer available, it's up here at the top. Just click it if it's grayed out, click it, and up pops the mixer for each of the channels that you have. I'm working currently in channel audio channel two, which you can see over here. So the question was... And so I need to enable an audio stream or ch uh, audio input plugin for that channel. And that's why it's helpful to put all of your sound effects on one, some of your audio on another, and your music soundtrack on another track. Because I'm now going to treat this entire track with, here on the right inside my mixer, plus Fairlight Audio, down about two-thirds of the way to noise reduction. Choosing noise reduction will allow me some options. The best for your, no your use, science to technology, is likely auto speech mode. This allows DaVinci Resolve to do what it believes is best for you, immediately. So the question was, is there something that I can do? You can see that it's a massive improvement. Here it is again without it. So the question was, and then in mid-turn I'm going to turn it on. So the question was, is there something that I can do? You can hear a significant drop in the amount of background noise. Something you may have noticed, however, is that my voice is a little tinny. It's not full. So there's some tricks you can play to make your voice sound a little fuller. The first would be to play with the threshold. This is the point at which noise reduction kicks in. You can uh, go for the attack. The attack is how quickly it kicks in at the beginning of a uh, sensed word or, or vocal audio track. And the sensitivity would be how sensitive it is to that background noise. And finally is the ratio. This is how much it dampers uh, when it does. The question was, is there something that I can do? It's a little cleaner just by me dialing back some of this detection. But here's a trick. Click on listen to noise only. And now you're going to hear everything that it's cut out. So this is, after you've got these settings set, everything that you've cut out. You can hear my voice a little bit. Those are the bits it's pulling away which make it sound less full. But what's amazing is that it's done such a good job. Sometimes you can really make out the words. Here we've done such a good job that it's pretty tough to even tell what that is. As always, just play with the options. It, you can't hurt anything, you can always turn it off. But this is how we've gotten from. So the question was. Down to. So the question was, is there something that I can do I think you can hear a pretty substantial noise reduction. Okay. So the question was, is there something that I can do? Just takes that background hum out. So that's the dynamic noise reduction that's available to you by default in DaVinci Resolve. It is fast and easy, and it can be applied across the entire track. Thanks for listening. Have a great weekend.